lot of um, discussion in there about whether or not Mr. Coleman is a flight risk. You were pretty adamant that he's not. No, he's. Uh, this happened on June 28th, and if uh, my client didn't intend to uh, stand tall and defend himself in, in court on this, he wouldn't have been here today. So, no, Mr. Coleman is not a flight risk. Uh, he, uh, he's very remorseful over this. Uh, he understands the situation that he's in, and he'll be in court when he's asked to be in court, no question. Facing some very serious charges, vehicular homicide. Uh, ag aggravated vehicular homicide is about as serious as it gets with vehicular homicides, unless they're intentional murders. Uh, it's a Class B felony. It is very serious, and uh, uh, I believe the prosecution has to prove not only that he drove while uh, intoxicated, but that he also uh, was drove recklessly. And um, uh, we'll just have to see what the proof uh, shakes out uh, in terms of that. There's a very big presence in the courtroom of the victim's family. They've made it clear that they are pursuing every possible charge and going to let the system go to work here. Well, as is their right, and, uh, and certainly uh, uh, I would be doing the same thing if I were in the, the position of the victims and victims' families. Uh, our heart goes out to them. I think the toughest part about this afternoon about my client was he couldn't lean over and say, I'm sorry. Uh, he really wanted to do that, and obviously this wasn't the time for that. So um, uh, I've done enough of these to understand a little bit about what the victims are going through, and the Coleman family's heart goes out and their prayers go out. Uh, to the Burkhards and, and, and their folks. Oh. Yeah, I thought it was a little over the top. Um, I don't know that you have to strap a GPS on every guy just because he's uh, charged with a particular type of felony. Um, my client has proven he's not going anywhere. Uh, he's done exactly what I've asked him to do from day one, and I have absolute confidence that that GPS was not necessary. Thank you.